Dr. Leo Prowitz, help if you could die, true. Come on in. The waiter is back. They're already laughing at me out there. <laughs> the waiter is back. So, we did a video earlier. It's called What's Inside the Waiter's Foot? He's got a clog sweat gland. And our famous waiter here, who has tons of views on his video, told me that he got a special treatment on his foot. He got reflexology on his foot and he loved it. He said it helped a lot. You want to tell us what happened? So, tell, tell them what you did and why it helped so much. Um, with constant feet issues, I was just recommended to a foot reflexology place. They specialize in, uh, obviously, feet. They have like the whole pressure points for each spot for what it helps with your whole body. Um, I didn't even tell them what was wrong. They just gave me a hardcore foot massage and it has alleviated so much pain, pressure, I can't even tell you. But take a look at this. Let me show you what's going on. So He's like got this together. Yep, huge porokeratosis and these are really tough to get rid of. We've cut it out multiple times. We've injected it with alcohol, cortisone, all kinds of stuff. He gets relief when we trim it down. But for some reason, this foot massage that he got gives them the most relief as long as it's trimmed down. But when you had the foot massage, it wasn't freshly trimmed down though, right? right? I got it trimmed down good. by you. Okay. And then once it healed, like two weeks later, I went there. Okay. And I went there once a month and they just, it's like 30 bucks for your feet and 50 for the whole body. So it's worth it. <laughs> and they went to town. Okay, so um, the waiter is actually a, a waiter slash bartender, right? I am. Do you sir. serve food too or no? Or just? I do, yeah, I do okay. anything possible. <laughs> okay. We're kind of the jack of all trades at the hotel. Okay. So he works at one of the well-known hotels here in Tampa, and he gets to see all the famous people, right? I do, yes. Yeah. He's the their secrets. bartender to the stars. <laughs> right. Do you want to give any secrets away today while you're... <laughs> oh, man. Any, anything, anything cool happen? Are we allowed to say that or no? Well, celebrities... They behave a lot more than people think they do. Uh -huh. <laughs> and unfortunately, because we all know who they are, they hide a lot more than we think they do. Um, but they're way more down to earth than you would think. Um, good people. They're good people. And who's, they tip well. <laughs> who's been in there lately? Are you allowed to say? Uh, have you seen? Well, we just we have a lot of athletic teams that come in. Uh -huh. um, I actually signed paperwork that said I can't say. But <laughs> uh -huh. oh, you do. it's, it's okay. a lot of fun. We all the bands that come into town to play uh -huh. concerts stay with us and the different athletic events stay with us. So nice. every couple of days it's a brand new hotel, um, but a lot of running every day. I average over seven miles a day. Um, so regardless of whether your feet hurt or not, <laughs> it's a long day. Oh uh, yeah. Okay, so this is the, the meat of the whole thing. This is the core of the porokeratosis. So what we're doing in the middle, there's a center core we're gonna trim this out, you doing okay? I'll do great. He is not numb. So what I'm doing is going down basically to the bottom layer of skin, the basal epidermis, and I'm doing it kind of a slow motion here. Um, and he still may feel a little poke here and there, he'll tell me, I'm sure. Um, but this is so I can get it out as much as possible. Our favorite bartender here hates needles. <laughs> so he did not want to get a shot beforehand. So that's why we're going to just kind of go real slow. So it's also good for video because it makes it nice and dramatic too. I'm not feeling anything. He's not at feeling all, anything. Yeah. Good, good, good. And I'm trying to get as much as possible. And I may go down to a point where he feels it somewhat, but this this is pretty amazing when you see what's underneath it. And if you look, actually it's not as deep as it used to be. How long ago was it? Was it four months ago? I would say it was four months since I've been here. Yeah, that's um, I think so too. We're gonna to do this again here with the core. I'm, I did um, one stroke here through the core, but I'm gonna go a little deeper this time. The problem is I just don't want to hurt him. So I can only do a little bit at a time. So I'm probably getting out of the five layers of skin, 2.5 layers at a time. How's that? I just made that up. It sounds pretty cool. Sounds it's, right. It sounds like I have perfect accuracy with this blade. Um, and I'm just making it up as I go along. That's how many layers I got. Oh, you feel that? I do. Okay. I'm so that's how I know. Now. That's how I know. Because the nerve endings are actually right underneath there at the dermis. That's where you get the 
the actual nerve endings to the skin are right there. And when he feels, and he can feel that little sharp, he will feel it. So and he'll tell me, and you're gonna see, this is gonna probably bleed a little there too, because I'm right down to where I wanna be. And that's as deep as we can go. So what I'm gonna do after this, I'm actually gonna probably take the Dremel and see if he can, can you tolerate the Dremel or no? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, I'm making it, am I hurting you right now? Okay. <laughs> is this freaking you out at all or no? Myself, no. Okay, really cool. Go. Okay. Yeah, well, I'm not going to act. I won't use the Dremel on you because you're, it'll probably be too sensitive for you. But this is it. It's just a a a, um, a few uh, strokes of the blade here. We got the whole thing off. Let me look at it on this. How close are at? Are you able to get real close? Let's see how close. Let's get this zoom it. Oh yeah. So we're looking at it. Oh, that's very cool. Through the new phone. And this is the new iPhone, actually. Not doing an advertisement for them, but the the it's actually the close up is pretty good, isn't it, Alexia? It is. Yeah. It's very good. It's not distorted at all. No, there's no distortion. It's pretty cool. I could actually almost do the debridement watching the phone, which is pretty neat too. Um, it's almost like old school arthroscopy where you look at a mm -hmm. scope. This is really neat, actually but I'm actually trimming the skin and I can actually see what I'm actually taking off of here because it's so magnified, it's crazy. This is pretty cool. He's not even looking at my foot, guys. No, <laughs> so right now I am not yeah. looking at the foot at all. I'm doing this by phone. So this is actually like a blind removal of a porokeratosis. Actually, that's what we might call this like video. a magnifying glass. How crazy is that? Yeah, so I am totally doing this looking into the phone and not at his foot. I am not looking at his foot right now. And this is really cool. And I think that's as far as we can go. The reason I'm going up and down like this is I'm just trying to really like stroke the bottom of the, the bottom layer of skin here without numbing them up. You're okay, that's probably hurting, right? Not yet. No? Okay, cool. Very good. And I think we're right about there. It's funny because I can actually I can see it better with a zoomed in. How many times zoomed are we? We're at 1.9 right now, zoomed in, and I'm wearing glasses that are, I think, 1.5s. So we really have this zoomed in here. I'm just gonna get this other side right here. So this reminds me of when I was younger and I used to play video games all the time. <laughs> right now, I'm I hope you were good at them. <laughs> yes, Pac-Man was my thing. So this is kind of like Pac-Man. We're gonna pretend the blade is Pac-Man and he's eating all this dead skin away. This is pretty good, this is great, okay. And that's it. Okay, now let me clean this up. I'm gonna move right say. here, let me grab some alcohol here. I do wanna say yes. real quick, yeah. um, if you're dealing with the problem or you're helping someone else out that is, you got to jump on it quick. As soon as it starts hurting, you got three or four days at the most you want to jump on it because you start walking differently because you're favoring it and then you develop knee problems or ankle problems. So it's something you want to jump on when you can. For sure. This might burn a little bit. Okay, let's look at this up close. Can you zoom in on that, Alexia? Let's see. I want to see what this looks like too. So I'm looking at it at the same time. Wow, amazing. Look at that hole. Okay, that's great. So that's out of there, that's it. That's gonna give him relief, he's clapping. Oh, bro, a round of applause, I'll give myself a round of applause. Um, pretty cool, but um, actually what this does, it gives him temporary relief. This is gonna come back for sure. They always come back unless you put something to destroy the core, alcohol, or if you put um, cortisone, that can be destructive to the core in the middle right here. Um, we're not doing that because he doesn't want a shot but sometimes they can put cream on it right after we do this, and he's using Cetaphil cream. Cetaphil cream is pretty strong. It will kind of eat away that dead skin, and there's that chance that it might just fill in from the inside out and go away. So 50% of the time, they get lucky and it goes away. So we'll see. The lotion's been working well. Lotion's been good. So bottom line is, you're gonna put some Cetaphil lotion, bring it with you, go get a massage, <laughs> have a good old time, and <laughs> Maybe reflexology will cure this. Maybe not, at least you'll feel better overall. We love reflexology because it makes your whole body feel better. So if you're considering doing it, the waiter slash bartender says, get some reflexology. <laughs> if you like what you see, subscribe to our channel. 
Instagram's great for those short um, videos and the short clips of pulling the nails out. Um, it's Healthy Feet Podiatry. It's at Healthy Feet Podiatry on Instagram. We'll see you for the next video. Thanks.